let's go and talk about the worst mistake that students make when identifying the x and y intercepts of a rational function. It simply is not simplifying and putting a x and y intercept at a discontinuity. Ladies and gentlemen, when you're working with a, a rational function, you need to make sure you always look to factor out that rational function to look for your removable discontinuities. So when I go ahead and factor this, which you have now is in factor form, I have rewritten this expression as a product. The reason why that's so important is because once you rewrite an expression as a product, you can now apply the division property for a rational function. Whenever you have the exact same expression in the numerator as well as in the denominator, those can now be divided out. What's important about expressions that get divided out? Those are what we call our removable discontinuities. They are not defined in our domain. What is the value that's not defined? When x is equal to two. So because two makes that zero, makes everything zero, and we know we can't divide by zero. So now let's go ahead and rewrite our rational function as f of x in simplified form, which is going to be an x plus two divided by a x minus two. Now I can go and identify my x, my y intercepts. Remember the x intercept is when y is equal to zero, or f of x, or simply you could just set your numerator equal to zero, so x plus two is equal to zero, so x equals a negative two. That is going to be my x-intercept, and my y-intercept is simply going to be when I take my constant over my constant. In this case, that's gonna be positive two over negative two, which is a negative one. But again, that mistake that students will make is they will skip, they'll get to factory, they won't apply the division property, or I'm sorry, they won't even go to factory. They'll simply just take my numerator and set it equal to zero. But if you do that, you'd have two solutions, x equals two, x equals negative two. Unfortunately, when x equals positive two, that is a removable discontinuity and not an x-intercept.